I didn't have high hopes. From what I'd seen from Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2, melee was not going to be viable and I was panicked. Especially when things like this were happening. Like what is that? Like, like what? No. What is that? You see what I mean? It just doesn't work, does it? Yeah, on the kill cam they're shooting the shield and I'm dying. But when I was about ready to give up, I figured out how to make it work. Oh, unlucky. Nice. Beautiful. Nice. Up that. <laughs> His mate's down, I think. So now, it's time for me to teach you how to make melee work in Warzone 2. So first things first, you want to land on a safe cracker contract. Those are good for getting cash, and as soon as you've got enough, you want to head to a buy zone and buy your primary weapon, the riot shield. Now this is just for safety. If the buy zone happens to have stuns, throwing knives or munitions boxes too, might as well stock up on those while you can. Targets are marked on your attack map. Now as soon as this happens, you want to head to your nearest stronghold. If it's more than say 300 meters, make sure you grab yourself a vehicle so you can be the first one there. On your way to the stronghold, make sure you keep pinging the rough location of the building. That's because if someone finishes it before you, the icon might disappear, but the building itself will stay there so you can still actually get your loadout. Chances are, other people want to do the same thing as you because they'll need their loadouts too. So they might chase you there for a long, long, long time. But luckily for you, that's why you bought your riot shield earlier, so you can take them out. Now you're at the stronghold, you just need to take out all the enemies, feel free to use your gun if you want, and then disarm the explosive. And now, you can purchase your loadout. Here's the setup I use. Riot shield, combat knife, stuns and throwing knives. As far as perk packages go, for some reason we can't customise our own at the minute, so you just want to pick the one here, Warden, which has fast hands. This is the most important because it lets you throw your equipment quick and swap to your shield whenever you're getting shot. Because you can't pair restock with fast hands, and fast hands is the most important perk, you're not going to have access to restock, so we need to get multiple stuns another way. But luckily with the new backpack system, you can store as many as you want. And here's how. Right, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to chuck that down. I'm going to replenish my stuns, then I'm going to stow them. No, stow, how do you stow? There we go. Then I'll buy another munitions, replenish them. Bosh. Then I'll stow them, then I'll buy another munitions. It's one way of doing it, isn't it? So we all know movement's kind of been nerfed in the Modern Warfare 2 engine, and there's not many techniques you can really do, but I have learned one, and I'm going to show you it. If you dive and switch weapons at the exact same time, it looks like there's nothing in front of you on your screen, but from the enemy's perspective, you've actually got your shield up, which means you're covering distance quickly, and you're kind of diving at them with a the shield up, which makes you pretty much invincible. And that's basically all there is to it. While most other melee YouTubers were crying about how difficult it is to get dubs, I was here trying to find a way to improvise and adapt. Before I show you some of the clips I hit this week, I just want to touch on how funny proximity chat is in this game. You fucking weirdo. Can you imagine sitting on top of there and dying? Can you imagine? I was I was trying to drink my cup of tea. Yeah, I'm sure you were. Who was your prick? <laughs> See, some people are kind enough to give away the whole planning game, so you can just adapt your gameplay to win the fight. How many people? One or two? Two. Two. So. Uh. Shall we push or? We can try. Yeah, let's try. I go one side, you go other side. 
Oh, time to leave. Yes, sir. Hmm. Not here. No. <laughs> but I see, I see. <laughs> oh, on me, on me. Shoot. On, on the. Ah, oh, he likes me. <laughs> he has very good. No. Hey, here's some advice. How about next time you don't tell me your whole plan? Hi. Hi, man. Uh, hello? No, please. Yeah, see you later, bro. No, no, no. Thanks for saying hi, though. Unlucky, mate. Hey, do you mind if I execute you? Thank you. If you just come out this way a little bit so I can just get the execution, that'd be great. Please. That'll do. Target spotted. Are you friendly? Are you friendly? Does that answer your question? Oh, you backed out. <laughs> and finally, let's end off with some of the clips. Oh, imagine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the f- What? What was that? Oh, what's he got here? Grenade launcher. <laughs> I mean, fair play to him. <laughs> Sit down. Nice. Good one. Get up. Summed them twice for you. Again. And again. Got them both. <laughs> Got one dead. Got him. Got one of them down. Oh no, behind me. Execute his friend, got most. That was very good. Stunder. Killed one, one's on me. Oh damn it, got 16 bullets left. Killed above. Two on me here, two on me here. Killed two. Two of them. Killed one. Oh, no, and everyone's executed. Nice try, kids. <laughs> Sweaty, dirty bastard. <laughs> That's me. I'm gonna stay this guy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I think I threw knife that other guy at the end of the clip. It just didn't show it for some reason. It's really dirty knife as well. Hey, GG. I'm very sweaty.